Today we are out on Lake of the Ozarks. You can't see them right now, but there is a lot of boats out today. There has been throughout the whole day. Um, I didn't really make an intro, so this is my intro now. But um, it was a tough day, but I managed to find some fish and find some new spots that are probably going to be secrets, so you won't see those. But I did catch a couple of fish today, so keep watching. That was my first bite of the day, a little Cinco. Fishing down this bank, trying to stay in the shade before the sun gets out too much. Big old Kentucky baby. There's just a little tree that's falling all the way across the back of this cove, and there's a nice little spot of bass. He's got real dark color on him. That's really cool. I've never seen one so dark in all the dark spots on his back. Heck yeah, baby. Alright, guys, I'm gonna give you the rundown of what's been going on. There's lots of boats out today, and it's been been pretty tough. I fished uh, lots of docks, lots of points and stuff, and I just started fishing down this bank, you can see. And I saw this big long fish swimming along, and I flipped my brush hog in front of it, and he followed it down and ate it. It's a pretty nice, pretty nice little fish. I'm guessing he's up there cruising looking for bluegill. So we're just going to keep going along the bank and keep my eyes open for everything, and hopefully, hopefully we can catch a couple more big girls like this make it a fun day. Not exactly what we're after today, but uh hmm. pretty feisty. Yeah, not what I was looking for exactly, <laughs> but it's fish. I kind of see a shadow, and I just dropped it right to the corner of the dock, and he come up real fast and ate it. So we're going to keep trying to do this shade pattern. Fish baby.
Not catching many, but better than nothing. Look at that funny shit bass. He got a little hump in his back. This fish head spin in the mouth. A little Kitek on there. It's probably about 15 inches. Like a pound and a half maybe. Alright guys, so what's going on is that these fish right here just schooling and coming up every every so often. They're eating little bitty shad. And with the fish head spin, what I'm trying to do is is have that little blade imitate one of those little little bait fish that they're eating. And then of course the swim bait, the big target for them to eat. So This is a guaranteed fish right here. Watch this. What did I tell you? That's a better one too. He's just fighting good. I don't know how big he is. Okay, he's bigger than the last one. Look at that. They're eating that thing good. Eating it good today. fish on the fish head spin. Now I wish you could kind of see that what's going on but these little schools of, of shad like an inch or two long are coming up and so this blade is imitating the shad and then this is a big meal for them so so they've been they've been eating that pretty good and I, I've just been throwing to different schools or whatever that I can see maybe a little little shad that are busting the top and bass underneath them. It's only little fish, but it's fun to catch.